What do all of these animals have in common? They all take Cosequin, the number one veterinarian recommended joint health supplement brand used to improve mobility and comfort in pets. So if your pets are showing signs of slowing down, it may be their joints. Try Cosequin. Whether it's your dog, cat, or even your elephant, help keep their joints lasting longer with Cosequin. Buy Cosequin today and get the best for your pet, the trusted brand everyone else compares to. Well, it's the tail end of our show, which means one thing. It's time for our tail end feature of the week. Several months ago, my furry friend Buka here hurt her right rear leg while herding the horses. Well, after several vet visits and many days wondering what was the right treatment choice, we decided to take her to see the experts who specialize in sports medicine and dogs. Meet Buka. She's six years old, full of energy, and simply loves life. That's why when my furry friend suddenly started having a hard time walking, I took her for a second opinion with one of the top centers when it comes to orthopedic surgery and rehabilitation. The whole center here from the hydro to the minimally invasive surgery, digital radiography, the gait analysis is all based around the human model for sports medicines. From ground level weight scales to no stainless steel tables and get a load of this, even rubberized floors for sure footing, this 16,000 square foot facility in Annapolis Junction, Maryland is quite impressive. Hi, hey, Dr. Marie. Dr. Knapp, nice to meet Great you. Great to meet you. Thanks and this is Buka. In. Hello, Buka. Yeah, hey, dog, I appreciate you squeezing us in today. Like I said, she's been having um, a lot of issues with that right rear leg and it's not getting any better. And did you see the event happen? Was she out running in the pasture? I was, actually, was... I was actually cutting the, the, the back pasture and uh, she ran past me. And all of a sudden I saw her come back over the hill, which was in, within what, not even a minute? Her right rear leg was cocked up. Curious to see what the general veterinarian that first examined Buka was calling everything from osteoarthritis to possibly cancer, I brought Buka's x-rays with us to see what was really going on. No signs of osteoarthritis in this knee, no signs of, of neoplasia or cancer anywhere, but that's just a little bit of shadowing, um, very clean. So. Why people should always get a second opinion, right? I agree. Um, second opinions are important. People do them, you know, everyone themselves personally, you know, should get one as well. Your children, I would take my child to a second opinion as well. It's also why you seek out a specialist. Give him a Buka. Walk. First test, a gait analysis to get a good baseline of the extent of Buka's injury. The important one for us right now is going to be pressure. How much pressure, how much weight are we actually putting on that leg? Look at that, 22 versus 42. So not bearing a whole lot of weight on that hind limb in the right. The slight motion seen with this tibial thrust test means Buka may have blown out her cranial cruciate ligament in her knee. Next step, more in-depth x-rays. So your dog's a rock star orthopedically. The issue is that we've injured her knee. When it comes to treatment options for a torn cranial cruciate ligament, a custom molded brace is economical and a good choice for senior dogs or dogs with medical issues. It does take time, they have to adapt to this uh, product or to these devices, so we have therapists here that will actually do rehabilitation therapy with the dog as they're learning to work with the actual device. That's I can't see my dog that. living like that. No, though. but some dogs don't have an option. Since Buka is young, healthy, and has many squirrels to chase in life, she's booked for surgery next week. We're going to try to do something to keep this femur from shifting down the back of the tibia. And when it comes to complete canine health care, I'm going to focus my light therapy there. You have to love this center's motto. Live better, feel better, play better. I developed that uh, when we first started, when uh, about five or six years ago. I thought that was awesome. It just it fit the whole entire picture. We'll be following Buka's progress over the next several months. For more information about any of the segments you saw on this week's show, log on to our website, yourlifetv.com. Remember, it's your life, live it, live it well. We'll see you next week. Bye, Buka.